Ahead of Samsung's next Galaxy Unpacked event on July 26, hands-on images of the Galaxy Z Fold 5 have leaked online, revealing a closer look at the device's design. While the leaked images reveal resemblance to its predecessor, the Galaxy Z Fold 4, there are a few tiny differences worth noticing. The images show the Fold 5's cover display, back, and the revised hinge, which now enables the device to shut completely flat. Although the general design stays the same, sharp viewers may notice minor changes in the rear camera system, which now has a bigger lens protrusion and a separate LED flash. One picture shows the interior folding display, but the quality makes determining if the crease is evident impossible. It's worth noting that the leaked unit looks to be a test model, since it has various identifying marks on both the front and back. The images were received by a Redditor who alleges they were posted by someone attempting to sell the unit. In terms of design, the Galaxy Z Fold 5 seems to concentrate on incremental improvements rather than big alterations when compared to its predecessor. Notably, Samsung has attempted to make the device seem slimmer when closed and has added a zero-gap hinge for greater aesthetics. While exterior design revisions are modest, the Galaxy Z Fold 5 is likely to deliver significant inside enhancements. According to reports, the Galaxy processor will be upgraded to the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2, which will provide quicker and more efficient performance as well as speedier UFS 4.0 storage. The device is rumored to have a main 50 megapixels camera, a 1-2MP ultrawide camera, and a 10 megapixels telephoto camera with 3x optical zoom. Finally, Apple fans will be disappointed with the iPhone 15 lineup update. We just learned that Apple is significantly improving the battery capacity of all iPhone 15 versions. According to reports, the iPhone 15 Ultra and 15 Plus will feature around 5000 mAh batteries, a significant increase over last year. As it turns out, that may not be the case. The source, a Foxconn employee from Weibo, has warned not to take his information too seriously, which doesn't completely dispute what he claimed previously, but it does imply that it was all a rumor. Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So without been said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.